Hello lovely math learners. Today we're doing 15 divided by 6 and Anna's going to tell us how she did it. Okay, what did you do Anna? Well, I'm going to split the 15 into 3 equal groups first. Oh, but we're supposed to split into 6 equal groups, right? I know, but I want to split it in and I want to put, I want to do 3. Okay, so we're going to start off by going 15 into 3 equal groups. So I have 15 here. And then here's one, two, three equal groups. Okay, so let's say that this is one of the equal groups, two. And now what I'm going to do to get six equal groups is I'm going to split these all into two. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see. So um, what's five divided by two then? Five divided by two, uh, into two is 2.5. Yeah, so I can like sort of put two and two, and then for each one of these ones, I can just put 0.5 and 0.5 in each one, right? Mm -hmm. Let's do the same thing here. 0.5. So now you've split 15 into six equal groups. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. So the answer is two. Point five. Huh, and there's 2.5 in each one. So 15 divided by 6 is 2.5. Fabulous, Anna. Thanks. Bye, everyone. Hi, everyone. Today we're doing 15 divided by 6, and Louie's got a really great idea to figure this out. Yeah. Okay, Louie, tell us how you did this. Um, well, first I know that 12 divided by 6 is 2. Oh, okay, so 12 divided by 6 equals 2. So let's bring stuff out so that people can see this. So we'll bring out, so basically this this also tells us that 6 times 2 equals 12, right? Yeah. So we'll bring out two groups of 6. So there's one group of 6. Okay. And we can even move them over like this so people see it. And we've got two groups of 6. And we've got total, 12 in total, but we actually need to do 15. Yeah, and there's only 12 there, so we sort of, like, need that there too, right? Yeah. Okay, so we got to figure out what either 3 divided by 6 is, or what times 6 would equal 3. Mm -hmm. Which one do you want to do? This one. This one. Okay, what times 6 equals 3? Um, 0 0.5. Or a half, right? Yeah. And look, it's half or six. Yeah. Okay, so we've got all these things here, Louie. We know that 12 divided by 6 is equal to 2. Mm -hmm. And like 18 divided by 6 is equal to 3. So we know this is going to be 2, right? Yeah. But we're going to have some kind of decimal there. I think it would, there would be 5 there. Ah, because of this, right? Yeah. So we grab this. And so 2.5. Yeah. So that means, though, too, for people, uh, it means 6 times 2.5 equals 15. Yeah. So we could think about it in terms of multiplication. Mm -hmm. But this is our final answer. Yeah. That was perfecto. Thank you.